Um, Jeff Wilson. We're at Treat Farm in Orange, Connecticut. Um, we raise produce, wheat corn, uh, tomatoes, uh, just about any kind of vegetable, pumpkins. Uh, we also raise Christmas trees, um, but we focus on vegetables uh, all during the summer. From We sell from the middle of July until Halloween. Wow, and I noticed you um, you just have your corn maze We do, we did a small the... corn maze for this year. Um, it's not a giant one, it's just to give people, you know, 15 minute walk through sure. corn. Uh, so we're giving that a shot and trying to get people out here a little bit more walking around. That would be great. How many acres are here? We have 90 acres total. I was going to, because it's yeah. expansive. Yeah, yeah, we go and we're on both sides of the street. So. Um, it's a little unique. We're in a residential area, so it's it's kind of interesting. Um, you, you get uh, you get a lot of people that ha aren't exposed to agriculture a lot, um, and they think it's kind of neat. So it helps us. It helps yeah. them. It's when in driving here you pass a bank and you pass a, you know some right. office shops and you get into yeah, this residential. I'm looking at my GPS going wait 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 I, yeah. okay it's here somewhere I right. know. <laughs> it doesn't look like it matches, but yeah, no, it, it puts us in a unique position here and it's um, it can use it to our advantage. Right? Sure. You have a day job. I'm an engineer in my real life, so I just do this. Uh, no no no, you're an engineer on the me. side, right? Pretty, pretty much at this point. Don't tell my boss that. But and you have some. Um, you have some impressive buildings. Some older ones. <laughs> and I some mean, more prioritized. The barn is from, I believe, the 1830s is the original part. It's actually three barns that they merged together. Can, to let's, this one. Yeah. can we walk so I can sure. keep seeing it? I mean, this is, was it two stories? Story and a half. Um, it's a story and a half. So it's a main dairy barn. Um, first floor levels of milking. Second floor was the hay storage. I'm gonna make this garden go. You know, we were, we, we grew up here. Um, you know, my sisters and I were raised here. We're kind of in a weird situation. We own this, this almost 100 acre farm um, in this area. Um, we're trying to keep it. Um, and not develop it or do anything like that. None of us went to school for farming. We're all different occupations. Actually, both my sisters are lawyers. Um, I'm an engineer, but we kind of, I guess it's sort of genetic makeup that we, uh, we work here and want to continue it to some extent. So that's what we try to do. Um, are you enjoying it? We do enjoy it. I think that's why we keep doing it and keep adding. It's kind of a challenge to see what we can do here um, and what we can make of it and, and try to make it so it's sustainable. Um, you know, we've done a lot of work, um, spent a lot of time, a lot of money to try to elevate it a little bit um, and it's trying to make it sustainable so our kids... So it can keep going down the line. Right. Do they yeah, like they being out here? They want with it, you know, we're not, I'm not one of those people, my parents weren't one of those people that are, hey, you've got to be a farmer. They actually made sure we did something else, went to school for something else, and this was always like a secondary thing. Mm -hmm. um, and it still has to be. Her love and care. 